Hey guys, in today's video, I'll be showing you how to install Stable Lineages 14.1 on any x86 PC or laptop. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So guys, before starting with the installation, make sure you have x86 PC or a laptop. Also, a USB drive uh, with the pen drive. So, you can see my pen drive is bitten by my dog. It's chewed totally by my dog, but it's okay. It will work. It works. So, I'm using it. And now let's focus on our laptop. So now just uh, input the USB drive into our laptop, into your laptop. So you can see it spotted the USB drive. Now you will need to download this files also. So I will tell you what to download. The download links are in the description. So please don't worry. So this is my folder and you can see the CM uh, x86 14.1 and here is the Rufus which will help you in uh, installing the Lineages 14.1 on your PC or laptop. So guys now just open the Rufus and just allow the permission and I can see the software is opened and here you can see create a bootable disk so just select the ISO image and browse for the image and select the image now so I will uh, select it uh, let's go here it's in this folder and you can see this is the ISO image so just open it here as you can see it has started loading it ok so ok new volume label it has there it's ok whatever it is so create it and just start it the image you selected is the ISO hybrid image it means it can be without an so you can see write an ISO image mode only okay all data on your device will be destroyed so yeah please back up the older data on your pen drive now it will start and it will take some time depending on your pen drive so if it is 8 GB it will just quickly and mine is 16 GB so let's wait till this uh, process ends so guys it's done it's ready uh, I just uh, clicked on start uh, because of this it got disabled now it's ready we will just need to turn off our computer or PC laptop what uh, sorry PC or laptop whatever you have just need to turn on turn it off okay. and my laptop is turning off now now turn on your PC by pressing the power button and when the boot logo appears of your PC just press the F12 button and there may be different uh, options of your related PC uh, to boot into this boot menu so now select this SanDisk Cruiser Blade or any your pen drive name it will be displayed so yeah nothing about it just it will be displayed and now you can see this screen so please uh, press the first option only don't go for any other options or you will get stuck at the installation now it can say uh, here you can see it's saying the detecting Android x86 and now it started uh, the installation so I'll just turn and you can see the Lineage OS boot animation uh, flashing on your PC or your laptop now I will just uh, skip this part until the second so finally my PC has been booted into Lineage OS and it took really uh, less time though check the language now you can see setup as fresh start and you can connect to a Wi-Fi. I will just quickly connect to my Wi-Fi here. So now you can see Wi-Fi is working. You can see the Wi-Fi symbol and there's the battery symbol too. And you can also set up your Google account here. So I will just quickly do it. So I've just signed it into my Gmail account too. And let's see what next steps they choose. So here yeah, it says getting found info and all things. So it's just a setup and we'll just clear it quickly. Put Google to work. Continue yes I'm in so you just need to skip this all set and now it will just do it so you can see enable privacy guards so all lineage OS features are there because it is pure and you can see we have the lineage OS and you can see they have uh, like home you can select taskbar or tribushet but I will choose tribushet always and this is the home screen of lineage OS let me just uh, reduce the brightness so uh, okay now it looks good now let's go into the drawer now you can just scroll your touchpad 
and let's go into uh, about tablet you can see Dell Watch Pro 3 5 5 at my device model and you can see Android 7.1.2 finally you know get on any PC yeah that's great really you can see all of the apps are there you can see the taskbar terminal emulator you can see many apps you can see the Linux OS apps let's move to settings and you can see you may, there is no customization at Linux OS you can see the status bar you can choose quick pull down uh, it's showing corrupted SanDisk uh, USB drive so yeah it will show like this but don't worry you can just install anything and here you can see the quick panel the notification panels you can customize and there are a lot of more options you can add to your quick panel there is also the android easter egg so you can uh, collect some cats here okay so i just quick down below in the settings again go into settings you can see privacy guard is also here the privacy guard is also here and uh, let's see buttons we get the software buttons here because we don't have any other choice for the buttons and yeah that's it guys for the Linux OS on your PC and I hope you'll enjoy this video uh, till now and the installation was pretty awesome and quick it's really awesome you can install it and this is the clock maybe some widget problem here happened okay I don't know what widget problem happened but it's okay and that's it guys for the Lineage OS installation and review on your PC and laptop PC or laptop anything you can install so guys that's it for the video if you really like this video press the like button if not press the dislike button also subscribe for more videos and I'll see you guys in the next one bye bye